Cat wants some wrestling, I guess. Okay, just stop. I know you're wrestling for something, and I know that you are strong. Hey, and good evening. Yeah, feels like evening, doesn't it? There's been this road construction right at the exit in this neighborhood. Like a project has been started. Yeah, project work. Tough job, huh? Long projects to get through. Something has been shaking in these bushes. Obviously, a snake was creeping inside of them, trying to crash into the berries. And fetch some of it. Yeah, hungry for the blueberries. A lot has got to get done on this day that it always feels like evening. Like it's always evening. And there we go again. This is not what evening really sounds like to me, to be honest. Like it's always evening today. And so it just didn't show itself this time. And yeah, this is the dog with only three legs. But what else have I got to say? It's just that it always feels like evening. Yeah, project work up on that road still to be continued. And so it just feels like two trains are passing each other. One going to the west, one going to the east kind of thing. This is pretty magnificent. Unlike that bring Sally out push up challenge or that level one to 100 push up challenge. It's nowhere even near like a crossword puzzle or a jigsaw puzzle, and or even if you're to create a Jenga puzzle. Wow, this would have been worth solving the Rubik's Cube puzzle. <laughs> like solving the Rubik's Cube in 30 seconds. Just like that, like turning one side of the block and let's say the entire first column is red, but the entire bottom row is white. I mean, what are you gonna do about it? Yeah, now in the middle of a Sudoku puzzle, when I try to put number five in the center block, but realize that I have it on the same row and think, ah, I should have put a number four there. Yeah, these cats ain't gonna follow me. These cats ain't gonna get the Sudoku puzzle right. They're just gonna keep continuing, keep putting ones in the same column. Yeah, it's just like the possibility of a cat running like a cheetah on the treadmill when going to Mac. It's even more of an impression when you go hunted down chasing. It's more of an impression than when you see a human or a cat run very fast on the treadmill or when they go on a power mill, they want to climb all that way up to the top of the mountain and they just want to go even faster so that they could show that, hey, I'm not a cat. I'm stronger than a cat. I'm even stronger than a cheetah, something like that. And other than that, when you plank for five minutes straight, when you first do the leg stretching, then you do the plank wave, and then you bend your knees, something quite like that. First, you turn them the other way around, and then you stretch into the perfect plank position. It's like you're preparing to score a penalty in football, kind of a thing. That's what it is. But at certain points, it's like you're planking for six seconds straight. That's the challenge. That's a task. Okay. Yeah. This is getting a bit more awkward right here. Don't you possess me, mate. Here. Just watch. Yeah, almost half the table is filled with paws, by the way. So, looks like you are trying to look for some mice. I know that. Oh, there comes another one already. That's his friend, his crazy friend. And gonna fill the rest of it. Mm. He doesn't speak. All right, doesn't matter. Well, at least you're not a big jack, are you? Are you? Oh. Well, at least he doesn't do the talk, 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 but he does the stretching and the athletics and stuff. Imagine doing an ex-workout challenge just to play in a movie, especially that pull-up challenge. And you want to play one guy that is seriously 
athletic, like does fitness every day. Oh, this cat wants some wrestling, I guess. Okay, just stop. I know you're wrestling for something, and I know that you're strong, and I know that you're like a lion, but I am not the right person for you to fight with. And it's just like me being the 29 times wrestling champion. At least this one's more calm and looks like another one is coming. Or even the fact that they could be hunting a mouse at this point. It's so strange that now it smells like grilled chicken in here. Just because of some cats living ring. But hey, I like it. And yeah, I guess this cat is hungry for chicken, huh? You want to go chicken hunting? Yeah, it does smell like grilled chicken in here at the moment. And you like to go hunting for chicken. Well, who would even like to give you chicken anyway? In fact, why would you go chicken hunting anyway? And I'm not gonna lie when I say that this looks very weird that we got a mix of seasons right there. Like, on the one side, it shows the autumn season, while on the other side, it shows the spring season, especially with these flowers surviving. It's like surviving the hardest next workout challenge for these flowers. This is pretty funny. <laughs> and what I mean by that is the pull-up challenge from the next workout. Well, yeah, that's just a good neighborhood exercise alternative there. I have no idea what in the planet these slippers are doing out there. That's just like the next workout one hour straight walk challenge. Or if you could even do a 30 minute straight running challenge. Shit, I thought I forgot something. But just having started my journey to MacFit, at least it's not raining at the moment. And so that's gladdening. Okay, I don't know how much more am I going to talk about hunting at this moment. Because now I got to... Oh, well, don't worry about the guys, but, you know, another couple of dogs trying to hunt down for some dead cats. Yep, that guy right there, folks. That guy that is... Um, yeah, that guy that was just standing way too close to the bus wall. The vehicle was about to start moving. You know what? Just don't worry about the hunters anymore. Now that so many of the birds have just come out here to piss off from the floor, that feels like mud while I'm walking around this park. Yeah, just having entered Mac, making jokes about next workout challenges, which I am about to do, and then acting in a movie as a seriously athletic character, especially as athletic as Superman from Marvel, even Spider-Man. Only we even know. It's just a comic. Those are just comics. And thankfully I got the chance to use this room at the top floor of MacFit. That's because the basketball area is closed just for the day, like they're doing a construction on this floor. And as long as it's not too busy, then there we go. It's like I'm acting and rehearsing. Especially when you see on the, or whichever video you go on for the next workout. And imagine acting as a wrestler in a comic film by at least feeling the strength to do half of the next workout challenges including the six pack exercises from that moment where Igor Votenko says, hey guys, what's up? My name is Igor Votenko and today we're gonna to be doing this challenge and that. And everything is sorted with that for today. And funny, it still feels like evening, the moment. Today is really a day that I can just say, feels like evening. And at least it's nice that they have this window open. Nice fresh air. Yeah, it is cold, but despite that, in the building, it feels very warm. It even feels humid. 
in the building. And this is like the only area that you can cool yourself down. And it wouldn't even be a major deal riding on this bike for 30 minutes. Like it will still not make you look as exhausted as running a whole marathon. Well, I could even made a fairy tale about a guy running a marathon, but I'm not gonna do a bike ride here. I'm gonna go downstairs and do it. Yeah, still that boxing going on there. Oh, what the? Man, I wanted to press two, but I accidentally pressed zero. Well, at least it's gonna stop. So it's at three at the moment. At least it's gonna stop at two first. Wow, what an outro. 40 minutes workout and then getting it all the way back to Huntington. 40 minutes workout, 11,011 steps in total. So that's just over 11,000. Wow, I could even be the guy doing 30 pull ups just for a movie. Imagine doing 30 pull ups just to get into a movie, right? Or being the guy in that movie, being that character that does 30 pull-ups. Anyway, guys, so that's the end of the vlog. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you in the next episode.